guys, it's Squid Kid Fortune 9, and I am back with a Beyblade video, and today I'm going to be showing you how to take apart your Beyblade. So I have a gray Veltriac, and I took it apart, and this is what the main piece looks like. Doesn't that look absolutely crazy? So yeah, I'm going to be showing you how to take apart, take it apart. See those screw things? That little gray dot. That's a screw. That's a screw notch. So first, you will need a screw kit, and you need a two size of like a Y shape. It's a pretty good Y, and it's a two. There you go. See, I've already took it out. So then you're gonna get your tyros. Then you're gonna get your grip that comes with the kit. You're gonna load your thing onto the grip. Then you're just gonna unscrew. You gotta put a little pressure onto it because Hasbro really tightens these things. So if you keep screwing, eventually it will come out. Here we go. Got it out. And it went across the floor. Here it is. So now I've got that hole in that there. Now I'm gonna... Oh, dang it. Now I'm gonna get my other one. Most Beyblade tops have either three or four screws, but this one, for some reason, only has two. So now you want to screw out the bottom part. For the other screw hole, whatever you want to call it. Man, this kind of takes a while. So, yep. Get your second screw out. Look, watch this. Look at that. Tyrell's just got taken apart. Hey, this kind of looks like Rocktivorous. You know, Rocktivore I1. Kind of looks like it's energy layer. So, yeah, you get three parts out of this. You get the clear part, the main attack body thing, then the QR code. Here's the QR code. Anyway. Alright, here we go. Dang it. Alright. That should scan. Okay, oh, okay. So I thought Tyros was like a perfect circle, but look at that. That's kind of like an oval. So then, if you want to put it back together, you can kind of, like, make it cooler. You can take the QR code out, or you could just leave it in there. You gotta kind of snap it back in there, though. Uh, okay, there we go. Then you put the thing back on, and bam, you've got it again. Well, you gotta put the screws back in, of course. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to try and take apart your own Beyblade. It was kind of fun. Yeah. And then also, if you have a Beyblade that is recolored, like, let's say, Veltriac, you can kind of customize by adding the silver part, which has, like, all the colors and stuff on it, to, like, or not the silver part, like, the clear part with all the colors on it to the base part, so it will kind of make its own, like, customized thing. So, yeah. Also, you can put this together with the Forge Disc and the Performance Tip by itself. You do not need this. You don't. Mm -mm. And you don't need to keep the QR code in there. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. That will be it for today. So, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And, yeah, see you guys in the next video. See ya!